Today on BattleBox.com, we want to find out if Nigerian men knows their way around this kitchen. Let's see if one of them can cook. Do you know your way around the kitchen? Uh, most definitely. Okay. Eh, most you, definitely. Okay, so can you cook? Uh, why won't I be able to cook? Okay, so what can you cook? Like there is not um, there's, a, there's no wala in that one. Can cook Indomie. <laughs> And um, I can cook, um, I can boil water. You can boil water? Uh, I can boil egg too as well. And so, egg? Exactly. So you can, can you cook? Um, I'm trying now, but I, formerly I wasn't good. Formerly you weren't good? I didn't even like going into the kitchen. You didn't yeah. like, okay, but okay, now that you are trying, what can you cook? Mm. <laughs> uh, okay, I can boil yam. Okay. <laughs> I can boil it. Yeah. I can uh, fry egg. All okay. that again. And plantain. And plantain. Just boil, fry egg, and fry. So you cannot cook stew. You cannot cook rice. Mm. You cannot cook jollof rice. If I do this stew, it means that I will not eat it. <laughs> because it's just few people that will eat it. So. It's, there is nothing. I feel I can't cook at this present time. Okay. So what can you cook right now? I can do rice, I can stew beans, soup, stew. Uh, I do not think any uh, a man <laughs> have anything to do in the kitchen. Ah, uh, so you mean you you won't you won't cook? Uh, hmm? You won't cook? No, I don't cook. Uh, so if you are the only one at home, so you will not eat. Uh, and I will buy bread and. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you buy bread? Yeah, of course. Yeah. On a scale of hundred, uh, one to ten, I would say five. five. I'll scale myself five. Eh, hey, so sure. at least that means you have a pass mark. Okay, so what can you cook? Well, at least I can make some stew. Stew? Yeah. What kind of stew? Okay, let's say something to eat yam or something to eat rice. I can cook vegetable, a furry roll, oh, you know. Oh, wait, you can cook vegetable? Mm -hmm. How would you cook vegetable? Please tell uh, us the steps. No, you know. You can actually cook your vegetable in a different way. So the way I cook my vegetable may be different from the way hey, other now. people cook their own vegetable. Hey, say it first now, okay? um, I'll use the uh, fresh pepper. Okay. And um, smoke fish. Uh -huh. and sometimes pomor. And um, what's it called? Locust. Um, this locust. Locust beans. Uh -huh. And what other thing? Vegetable. The green one. And I'll put the. I'll put an oil in a pot. And I'll fry it. Oh, oh uh -huh. okay. And I'll fry the pepper, and just I'll just mix everything you up. You okay, what you're saying that you at, the end, at the end, at the end, at the end, it's going to taste pot. most definitely. You now. Put everything inside that. And at, the, at the end, it's going to taste very good. Okay. Rice, beans, so you some can... good soups. Good soup. Yeah. Okay, so what soup can you can you cook? Uh, Egusi and vegetable. Uh, Egusi and vegetable. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I know how to cook very well. Okay, so what can you cook? Um. The normal official food, rice, beans, um, stew, sauce, I mean sauce, then um, what else? Vegetable. I can cook, I can cook a goosey. Eh, so yes. how would you cook a goosey? Please uh, teach us. A goosey, if I want to cook a goosey, in the first uh, place, I will have my pot on the stove. Okay. Um, get your oil. A goosey have two ways of, you don't fry a goosey. Okay. But another way you can fry the main melon. Okay. If you want to, you really need um, the oil from it. Okay. Like my 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 grandmother doesn't use the oil. You first of all fry the egusi. After frying, the oil you come out from the egusi. By the time you cook, you doesn't need any oil again. For those of you that don't know how to cook ogbono soup, we have somebody here that's <laughs> going to give you the process and yeah, how know, and how long it's going to take. On, okay, okay so I, I, now I wouldn't like to talk now, about how now, I make it. <laughs> How to make ogbono soup? We are far away. Okay, how to make ogbono soup? Ah, I believe the simple way for those who doesn't know how to make it could go through uh, simply by putting the pot in the fire at first. Then afterwards, you add um, a little bit of um, palm oil into the pot and add was it called crayfish into it and some granite pepper if you want to. And um, what else? Yeah, you had some maggie to it, like two cubes, uh, uh, two cubes, yeah, two cubes, and a bit of salt. And after you leave it to like boil up for like five minutes or so, and 
you reduce the fire underneath and add a little bit of water for it to cool and then you can pour the ogbono powder into it and stir it for it to start drawing yeah that's it that's, okay yeah. let's let's now seek the, the, the answers from our judge or do two percent so you, see, you don't know how to cook at all yeah like come you on. don't know how to cook at all you know what i just said this this is a simple way for those who don't know how to cook and this now, is a very a, simple way but if teacher. i should go through the process so i use like they will go nuts so i don't want to enter. And, and that is all we have for you nigerians you know now nigerian men we can cook don't come and be bribing so if you want to come to my life and you don't it's only food you want to offer me you have to try you Man, I can cook so many soup. I can cook. <laughs> Let, let's just talk about that later. I'm Karen Ognaike, and you're watching Battlebox.com.